Hi guys, it's Sebastian with Smelling Great Fragrance Reviews. I'm here in Florence, Italy, and I'm with Elena of Santissima Annunziata, an old, old pharmacy that now produces niche perfumes. And she's going to tell you about the brand. It's been around since... 1561. 1561, so old. So to find out more about this brand, guys, stick around. So what does the name mean? Okay, the name, many people think that it's because of the church. We have uh, Piazza Santissima Annunziata on our right. On the other side, we have the Duomo. But uh, I made some researches. And if you go outside, we have over the door a round uh, annunciation where the Holy Mary was annunciated from Angel Gabriel. Mm. And Holy Mary is uh, the annunciated, so annunciata. But she's a saint and Santissima, more than saint. So uh, in 1700, they used to say, oh, the pharmacy had the sign of the Santissima Annunziata telling that it was below the sign. And oh. slowly, Farmacia Santissima Annunziata. Oh, wow. This is a very old place. Uh, we are a family business. And we are here, not with the family, but this place is here since uh, 1561. So it's 457 years old, this place. And uh, my mom took this place in the 70s. And uh, there were some products, cosmetic products, like creams, and few creams, and my parents kept on producing them. From few, they started to produce more and more. So we started from the cosmetics. And slowly, we, uh, we made more products because people are asking for more things. So we try to enter in the target, in the target and in the field of the niche market with the fragrances. So they are not normal fragrances. So we study them in a, a special way. They don't have to be easy and uh, like many that you can find a normal perfumery. Uh, at the beginning we started from few, uh, we like um, Greek names, for example, it's a Ile, it's a Greek name, Ile means a raw material, or for example, Takis means fast, going fast and doing something fast, or for example, let's say, Sofron, many people think this is uh, saffron, but the saffron means to be whiz. Is it right? Whiz. Um, there are some. Then slowly we change to more the name more related to the fragrance. Let's say uh, tal gourmand is something gourmand, so sweet. Or ambra nera, amber, so you know directly because people, you know, when the market changes, so people wanted to know exactly what was in the in the fragrance. Okay, even if here you can find all the notes, when we sell something, so people already knows, know what's inside. And this is the last perfume, Giardini di Firenze, because we want also something that relates the perfume with Florence. Because we are here, the store is here, so the gardens of Florence, so Tanti that reminds the gardens. And now we are going to present a new fragrance at the exhibition. The name would be, should I say that? Okay. Um, uh, whiskey Oud, so it's a Oud with whiskey, Macarlan whiskey, and um, you, you will see that. From this line, uh, related are shower gels, body lotions, or deodorant, aftershave, many different products. And then what else? Uh, see, deodorant. Then we try to go also to the roof fragrances for another, no, not another, also the same target. And we took the story of this place because we are in the building of the Middle Age. So Arti Maggiori, Major Arts Corporations. So there were seven, so seven fragrances. Colpuri, fragrances, small, you see with the sticks. Those are recharges, refills, little bottles. We are going to present uh, some Christmas kit at the exhibition and also a new size because we have the big size, 500 ml, 
250 ml and we're going to present the 100 ml. Let's say the one that it's really related to us. It was uh, six years ago for the anniversary, 450 years. And um, we are in Florence. The symbol of Florence is uh, Giglio, Iris. So this is a smoked Iris. It's, uh, it's not typical Iris, but you feel it not immediately, sometimes okay, you feel it immediately, but not uh, usually it starts with a little bit spicy. And this is unisex. So we sell it really a lot. This is the best seller. I also use it. And men and women, they like it. So this is our, let's say, symbol. Our 450. That we sell a lot. And then the, another best seller after 450 is the one that I showed you before, Ile. This is um, like the seaside, you know, the ocean. You, you, you can feel the, the ocean and breathe it. Also unisex, I would say, very fresh. We have everything for every taste because we have fresh, uh, sweet, uh, spicy. Uh, let me see. Ah, another one. It's very Kia. Kia. This is not Greek. This is an uh, old Colombian language mm. because we like short names. And Kia means uh, moon in a old Colombian. And this is uh, sweet with um, with vanilla, talc, and people like it a lot. And then another one, Isos, that means equal in Greek. It's spicy. It's uh, with black pepper, green pepper. So those are, let's say, people like them the most. But fortunately, they like many of the, of the line. Before this line, we had uh, more traditional perfumes, also with uh, Greek names, because we like short names. And those are very traditional. Maybe too much. So now I'm working on them to make them a little bit more modern. But those are the ones that started with us with the cosmetics. But they don't meet so um, uh, such a, a big audience, many people. So we have to, to make them more modern. Two of them, we took them, for example, Care is the name of our firm where we produce everything. Men's in Greek. Uh, love, life, everything. It means the destiny, everything. It's a classical man perfume and we use this for the man line, cosmetic man line. The other, another one is Jaya. Jaya means earth, in, uh, also in Greek. It's the perfume that gives the perfume of all the precious line. It's another cosmetic line. So we also have a traditional side, but I'm working on them. <laughs> Very soon. Can you tell me what's the difference between you and Santa Maria Novella, which everybody knows, but they might not know your brand? So the difference between us and Santa Maria Novella are, is that, okay, many people get confused between us. And they go there and they come here. I see directly what the people do and what they buy. They are more famous, they are much bigger. And uh, okay, they started before to spread in the world, but now, and we are a little bit older, 50 year olders, and this is what people, for example, like, because they like old people, old um, uh, brand with an old story. And let's say that over there, people buy, I tell you what clients say. I, I, don't, I don't give my own opinion because um, I don't want to. But they go there and they buy because they like the brand and they say it's very expensive. But they come here, because, uh, okay, we are not so expensive. And they like the product, also the product. Because we think that it's very important to buy the brand, but also the product. Because if you don't like the product, you're not going to buy it anymore. So they told us that cosmetics are very good. And um, especially with cosmetics, is the comparison. Like perfumes, uh, they tell me that they don't have such uh, special perfume. But always people say that. And they have a beautiful place where you can go. 
and what else? Ah, this is also good for us because, um, for example, from Japan, from Korea, many come here and they want to export to import in their country because uh, they say everybody knows uh, Santa Maria Novella, but we want something older, something different. So this is also good for us. It's a good competition. We don't fight, we help each other, a good cooperation, let's say. Can you also tell us where people can buy it? My audience is mostly in the USA. I know Lucky Scent sells your products. I bought, I bought the patchouli from them, mm -hmm. and I have it, it's a good one. Yeah. Um, but tell, tell the audience where they can buy it in the USA, in Europe, and elsewhere as well. The patchouli is also a good perfume, but it's very strong, not for everybody. So you can also mix it with other perfumes. And in the US, okay, Lucky Scent in LA, and not so many shops. We are not really in the US um, yet, but we think in the future. We are in New York, uh, in Florida, just uh, a pair of shops in New York and one in Florida. But we, we ship everywhere in the world because we sell through the website. So we, we arrive everywhere. At the moment we uh, have in Florence, uh, let's see, um, three locations. Because uh, this was a real pharmacy, a pharmacy with medicaments. A few years ago we moved the pharmacy as an activity in north of Florence with also the products. Here we have only what we produce. And then two months ago, we opened another little shop in the, right in the center of Florence, in Via Porta Rossa. And uh, right like this one, it's a little twin, because uh, people that come in, they have to recognize this place. So they have to think to be here. And, uh, and what we would like is to transfer this thing everywhere all over the world and Italy. Let's see in the future. One of the fragrances that we featured in our patchouli video was a fragrance from uh, Santissima Annunziata. It's the patchouli, this one right here. Dahlia and I both really love this one. It's a great, great, very cold and uh, slightly metallic patchouli fragrance. This is one that's sold here in this pharmacy and I totally recommend you guys try this one.